after Sam Rush. The best way to deal with a bank account overdraft is to scream uncontrollably until you die. (laughs) Preferably while staring at your computer screen where your available account balance is surrounded by parentheses like maybe it's just a nice hug or a hostage situation and not some computer programmer's stupid idea to try and make a negative account balance look any less terrifying because I still don't have any money, fill, and punctuation isn't going to change that? (laughs) Or the best way to deal with a bank account overdraft is to gather all of your emergency cash, deposit it as soon as physically possible, and then plead with the bank on the phone the next day to please forgive your overdraft fee because they're charging you for having no money. And in order to have enough money in the bank to not be charged, you need the money that they charged you. The best way to deal is to never run out of money. Buckle your brain into a chair at the library and apply and apply and apply for jobs until your resume looks like a preeminent obituary. And every cover letter is just another way of saying send help. Lower your standards to the ground and hope they don't ask you to lift anything too heavy like your head off the pillow when you wake up again to ears ringing like tired church bells, which is to say... Stop being so lazy. You're too young to be disabled. Stop moping around. You're too talented to be depressed. Stop listening when your body tells you to stop. Always make money with your broken body. Always surround that money with more money so it never gets lonely. Don't make those banks feel empty. It's not their fault. They are thirsty faucets in reverse, which is why the best way to deal with a bank account overdraft is to become the bank and then burn it to the ground.